If you think about watching the news on TV, you'll know just what an overlay is used for. It's a transparent slide that overlays the screen with a small digital graphic. It looks something like this. It's used to increase brand awareness. In this case, the brand is the broadcaster, but in the case of your video presentation or digital signage, the brand you'll be building will be your own. In this video, I'm going to walk you through how to add an overlay to create brand awareness when running video kiosk. Let's get started. You can set up video kiosk to use an overlay in five easy steps. Step one, create an overlay file. Step two, rename the overlay file using the file extension overlay.png. Step three, Move the overlay file onto the device running Video Kiosk. Step 4. Update the Video Kiosk settings with the overlay file to use. Step 5. Launch Video Kiosk. Here's each step in detail. Step 1. Create an overlay file. Create a PNG with a transparent background and add your logo in the corner. For step-by-step -step instructions, refer to the tutorial available on our site. You'll find the link below. Step 2. Rename the overlay file using the file extension .overlay.png. This is so Video Kiosk will recognize it as an overlay file instead of treating it like just another image to display. Step 3. Move the overlay file onto the device running Video Kiosk. You can do this using a USB cable or using Video Kiosk's Cloud Update feature. Step 4. Update the Video Kiosk settings with the overlay file to use. And Step 5. If you haven't already done so, launch Video Kiosk. For example, Jeff runs a small coffee shop, and he uses an Android TV to entertain his customers while they wait to order. He used to show the news, but now he shows a loop of pet photographs supplied by his customers. His customers often tell him how they love the pictures, especially the kittens. He wanted his customers to associate that good feeling with his business, so he thought it would be a good idea to include his company logo in the presentation. To do this, he downloaded the Video Kiosk sample kit and added one of the overlays from the sample kit to his Video Kiosk folder and updated it to his Android TV. He then updated the settings with the overlay to use. Video Kiosk displayed the pet pictures with the sample overlay displaying a logo in the corner. Not exactly the business he wanted to promote, but now that he had his digital signage working the way he wanted it to, he was confident he could create an overlay of his own. Using the instructions in the How to Create an Overlay tutorial, he created a transparent slide with his logo in the corner using Keynote on his Mac. The tutorial said he could have created it using Photoshop Elements or using PowerPoint, but it was easy enough to do using Keynote, so that's what he did. Then he renamed the file with the extension .overlay.png, added it to his Video Kiosk folder, and uploaded it to his Android TV, and configured Video Kiosk with the overlay to use. And because Video Kiosk is designed to run without interruption, once he configured the settings, Video Kiosk started using the overlay automatically. No restart required. Now that you've watched the demo, it's time for you to do it. We've made it easy for you to do what Jeff did because you can download both his pictures and his overlay from our site. Just follow these steps, pausing the video until you've completed each one. Step one. If you haven't already downloaded Video Kiosk to your Android device, download it now from the Play Store. The trial version that you download will display a watermark over the screen, but all the features work, so you can try them out before you buy. 
When you buy video kiosk, the watermark will be removed. If you don't have your Android device handy, you can run this demo on your Android phone. Step 2. Now, download the overlay sample kit from our site. Step 3. Open the sample kit. Find the video kiosk folder and copy it to your device. If you're not sure how to do that, just watch the How to Use Cloud Updating tutorial available on our site. You'll find the link below. Step 4. Configure Video Kiosk with the overlay file to use. When you exit the settings, Video Kiosk will begin playing the slideshow. And you'll have a digital signage display with a company logo overlaid in the corner of the screen running on your Android device. Then, all you need to do is create and upload your own overlay file and upload your own media files. For instructions on how to create your own transparent overlay file, check out our tutorial How to Create an Overlay, available through our YouTube channel or through our website. In just a few minutes, you'll have created your own overlay file and be one step closer to going live with your own inspiring digital signage presentation. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. For step-by-step -step instructions on how to use Video Kiosk, check out our tutorials, available on our website and on our YouTube channel. And for printed step-by-step -step instructions on all of Video Kiosk's features, download the Video Kiosk User's Manual. You'll find the link below. If you found this video helpful, please leave us a comment.